guys, I'm the Anime Uprise. How's it going? Today, we have another manga review. And this time, we're doing a kinda classic anime manga. I guess it's not really classic because it's Baruto. But you guys already knew that. <laughs> Volume 3, Boruto. I'll talk about that first. <laughs> It's basically the ending of the Naruto, Boruto movie, where they fight that one guy, Momoshiki, yeah, his guy, that guy's name. He, he fights Momoshiki, they finish it up, they wrap it up like the Naruto movie, with some small changes. Like he comes back in like a different corpse kind of form, and like he gives Boruto like a hand mark, he says like, you can't, if you're gonna be powerful, you can't be the same as everyone else. So it's, it's kind of weird. It's kind of making a different approach. It's kind of making things more progressive and not so boring. Which, they, yeah, so it, it basically goes on with the basic Boruto Naruto movies type deal with some changes. And now that like, gets to the main point I want to talk about. Like, the, my reviews ain't so much reviews. They're just sort of me talking about the series, which is not that bad either. <laughs> so yeah, I, I just said it in just point form here, like I, I just told you. It's about the same thing, same way as the Boruto movie. And if you haven't watched the Boruto movie, then watch that or read the manga, because I don't got the talent to explain it to you. Anyways. Now the things I want to talk about is the, the since I'm doing a board, I'm not, I'm not going to be like specializing in Boruto probably in a while, so I do want to emphasize something like this. I might have talked about it a long time ago, I'm not sure, but right now the manga and the anime are taking totally different approaches. So at first, I was like, okay, the manga is, is doing the same storyline. I'll wait until I start collecting them. But I decided to start buying them anyway, and I did. At first, I was like, okay, well, man. And when the anime started for Baruto, I was like, oh, dude, this is fresh. This is new. I'm getting, it's for sure it's before the tuning exams. It's like they're going before instead of after, but it's something new, right? Instead of getting the same thing right off the bat, which was kind of refreshing, but after a while, it kind of got old. And for Boruto, it took two volumes, only two volumes to get past the, the part we already knew. And it's doing so much more action scenes, it's not so much more amount of time. The Boruto anime, on the other hand, is more of a slice of life than a shonen. <laughs> sure, we get some fights here and there, but it's not like the Boruto manga. We're seeing way more fights, way more action, way more... I don't know, it just gets right to the point. It's not like beating around the bush, it's not giving filler episodes, it's just... It's not a cash grab. Well, it might be. But it's not as obvious as the anime. Because frick, man, it does its job way better than the anime could. Of course, the anime has a better art style. Because they've been having Naruto for years. And I get there's some flaws between Kishimoto and the new artist's art style, but I don't mind it. Like, sure, it's, like Naruto and Sasuke look a tiny bit different. The art style looks a little tiny bit stiff. But it's something else. But yeah, so the difference between the anime and manga, I guess it's kind of... What to say? The manga's more straightforward, and the anime just around the bush. It, it goes around, tells the longer story, while the anime cuts corners, or the manga cuts corners. 
The anime tells a full, detailed story which might not always be entertaining. Well, the manga, it just like, okay, get straight to the chain, so get right to the, get right to where the money is, get to the fights, get to the transformations, get to the new tower reveals, get to all the important things fast. And I love that part of the manga. Like, I've enjoyed reading the manga far more than I've enjoyed watching the anime, because one thing, it doesn't take 50 episodes to start rolling on the freaking actual freaking thing. So this is actually really good. But, I think I'll wrap this anime review up for now, because it's honestly, I don't think I need, to, I don't think there's any more need to be said. This was a good book, like the manga. If you're gonna go for Baruto, honestly, get the manga. The manga is way better. And it's coming from a guy who watches the anime first. Usually when he wants something first, like that for me. But this is the first for me. I you would think since I watched the anime first, I like the anime better. No, the manga, ten times better than the anime. Guaranteed, unless you love Slice Life, then go ahead. But I'm if I'm going for a shonen, then I want to get a shonen. <laughs> Anyways guys, let's wrap up this video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you didn't did, please leave a like, subscribe for more, and I will see you guys all next time.